What's up, YouTube? Been that caller here with an update. Ready to kick ass. Take names. Halloween's around the corner. October. Hell fucking yeah. All right. So let's get on with the awesome edit effects. Cheers going out to all my crew and L of the week. I'm drinking some Coors. Been digging this beer recently. It's awesome as hell. Um, yeah, man. Love you guys. Cheers. All right, let's get on with the meat and potatoes here. Excuse me. All right, I picked up A Films to Die For After Dark Horror Fest 3. Great set, of course, because you don't have to buy each movie separately, which is an ass, which I've done before. Highlights Perkins 14. Badass zombie flick. And I actually dug an autopsy. I've yet to see the these bottom three, but I'm sure I'm not missing much. Alrighty, check this out. Is that badass or what? Look at that cover fucking art. God damn, psycho kickboxer. Yeah, I saw this trailer. You know, thought I'd see the scene in the movie. Actually, you don't see it, but. I love this movie. It's freaking cool, man. It's really fucking cool. And it's low budget. Um, the director, he's like an actual, like, kick ass motherfucker. That's him right there. And he spent a lot of money, of his money, to make this movie. And that's love, man. I love that shit. And I support it. So, Psycho Kickboxer. Pretty fun, though. I enjoyed it. It was really cool. So we're getting to some beating on some people kind of shit. So let's beat on some wrestling shit. Calamari wrestler. Yeah. That was pretty cool, man. Like, this is like comedy, but at the same time, just the effects that are thrown in to, like, make the squid alive and the story involved is, like, just so worth your time. If you want to take a break from the gore and and the, and the sleeves, and you just want to, like, throw some comedy, I definitely recommend uh, Colin Murray Wrestler. Pretty cool. Like, if you're a big fan of Sushi Typhoon, and there's no disc in there, like, because I'm, I'm watching it again. It's a good fucking beer flake. And I'm drinking beer. But, by the way, yeah, of course, send me some beer. All right, guys. So lately I've been into um, reading Takeda. I'm trying to drop on again. And by the way, uh, if you've seen my last video, my nails are still dirty. But anyways, Rina Takeda, look at her. Look at those legs. Oh my goodness. Yeah, I picked up High Kick Girl. And um, didn't disappoint. This is like her, her, one of her youngest roles, in show, I, be I believe. I'm sure Monkey Cube will school me and tell me all about her because he's a fucking he's a go-to guy when it comes to Asian like horror exploitation anything he's the man. But I enjoyed this movie. It was really fun, the beginning, but the end did fucking lack and a lot. So with my fetish of Vina Takeda, I picked up some of her other shit, Karate Girl. Excuse me. Karate Girl's fucking fucking fun. Fuck. Fuck. Fucking fuck. Fucking fun. No, that wasn't an edit. That was an actual fucking me speaking. Oh my goodness. KJ, what? Huh? No. Running out of material here, guys. Stop sick. What? Grace. Awesome fucking movie. Yeah, tit mutilation at its finest. Pretty cool. Picked this up at the pawn shop, three bucks. What? Never seen it before. Can't beat that. Awesome. The Nisho de Toro shit. No. What? Oh, the Guillermo del Toro shit. Excuse me. I love the Nisho, though. It's fucking awesome. If you're in love in Las Vegas. Oh, man. Excuse me. I had a moment there where I was. Tripping on shrooms. Anyways, getting back on subject. 
Get them with that Toro, Pan's Labyrinth. Fucking awesome. Pick this up finally. I, I've seen this before, but I've never owned it. And it's not nothing snazzy. So I also wanted to pick up his uh, Blade uh, Part 2. So I picked up this. Well, this is pretty snazzy, in my opinion. You know, I'm not going to fucking pull him out and shit. Yeah, that's what she said. Pull it out. No, I said, hell no. Nah. Anyways, uh, Scanner Darkly. <laughs> What? I've not seen this. I remember my homeboy, Tyler Doyle, the uh, good, bad, unusuals. He told me this shit's kind of, like, boring. But I'm going to give it a try. I have not got there yet. I will get there, brother. And we'll see. Kiana's pretty tough to look at. I know. I know. It's tough. My pickup of the week, my Facebook friends, my brothers from another mother. Vampire Girl versus Frank Sangro. And, uh, of course, I have seen this on... I saw this on YouTube, actually, like, back in 2010, I believe, or 2000... So, sometime around that time when I started picking up shit, you know, when I was new to the game, and... I picked it up. Bye. I'm just kidding. Anyways, that's going to be the update. I have nothing else to say. There's nothing else going on in the world. Um, do you want to ask me some questions? I might answer them. Yeah, man. So, uh, cheers.